So CTE is career and technical education. And what it is, it's, it's really, we provide all the career oriented courses, but it's the exploration of careers. There's so many career pathways that our students are able to explore at this age versus going into post-secondary ed, then not, un or they're unsure about what they want to do with their life. They are exposed to uh, acquiring the skills and taking the opportunity to take an exam during their high school coursework that will give them the opportunity to go straight into the workforce and uh, make a great living. We offer from courses in welding, cosmetology, instructional practices, health science, CNA, pharmacy tech. Uh, the list is endless. Students don't have to worry about where they're going to get their tuition to be able to pay for these classes. For instance, let's just take with cosmetology. I think right now tuition may be in the, in the realm of $20,000 outside the school system. And these students are able to earn the exact same certification that they would take as if they went to a, a community college. And they don't have to worry about tuition. They get to earn that before they even exit high school. Many of our teachers have been here for a very long time, so they're very experienced, very knowledgeable, and very eager and excited about passing on those and teaching those skills to our current students. We are ecstatic about having a new building being constructed at this point, and then as well having two of our existing buildings be uh, remodeled, and that is when we are really going to expand to be able to offer Courses that we don't have, such as HVAC, electrical, diesel mechanic, plumbing, a firefighter program, barbering, where there's so many different classes that we're gonna add to what we currently have. The process has been long, but we're very anxious and very eager to be able to provide those other course offerings for our kids. Well, the first building, the expected completion date right now is December of this year. So we're very much looking forward to that first step. And then for the other two buildings, we'll hopefully will be the upcoming school year after that. To our board, our superintendent, our executive committee, we are very grateful. Our students are very grateful. Our teachers are excited. I think this is just uh, something that we have been looking forward to for a very long time and it wouldn't have happened with our board and our administration.